what is the purpose of human existence on this plane? What is our objective in this lifetime? Man, I've, man, I've answered that so many times in so many videos. You are an immortal personality. You are here to develop your divine soul. Because this is ending fast. We are heading toward a terminus faster than you think. And it doesn't matter how old you are. It doesn't matter what your age is right now. If you're 73 years old and you're listening to my voice right now and you're convinced 100% because you've seen my published materials, my data sets, you've got a calculator out and you've looked yourself. You have cross-referenced my findings on May 2040 with Mother Shipton, with Nostradamus. You have looked at my citations of the Dutch Orlin manuscript, the Book of Jasher. You have gone through all my archives. You have watched every single video, read all nine of my published books, all my unpublished manuscripts, and you're 73 years old right now and absolutely happy that you will not be alive in 18 more years when these events begin to unfold I have bad news for you because if you died two years from now at 75 years old you would be a 15 year old kid when the Phoenix appears doesn't matter every single person will live through the apocalypse every single one and this is why i'm trying to educate people to understand that the apocalypse is an unveiling it is the wicked it is the evil sorry no good elitist bastards geeky followers of aix who want the entire collective fearing the apocalypse because they want people to suffer with them it's simple as that but that's not how it's, how, how it's really going to go down. The apocalypse is an unveiling and a, it's an absolute empowering event to those who have built up sufficient informed fields to realize that, hey man, not only am I holy, I am one of the elect, I am one of the chosen, I am, I am, I am an errant. I do not belong in this world, I am not a part of the collective masses. I do have an immortal brethren family, and I know them by what they say out of their mouth. And I can identify them in any crowd when I hear them speak. But I am not, I am not with these others. The apocalypse has always been about punishing Read Book of Revelation. It specifically says, And the kings and the rulers and the princes of the earth grew terrified, and they ran to the mountains, and they hid in the caves, and they hid, and they hid from the face of the one who appears in the sky. The apocalypse is about punishing the wicked for how, punishing the elite, the wicked, the rulers of the earth, all their servants and lackeys, all, everybody who, who, is, who has helped their agendas, punishing them. But it's not about punishing those who haven't, who, who haven't done anything to be punished for. Because every time the world is destroyed, what happens? And the meek shall inherit the earth. It happens over and over and over. But now we're coming to a terminus. This cycle is about to collapse. And I have other videos explaining that holography and how we know this. So, again, I'm trying to preach to you guys. I don't, that's why I'm not, I'm... Nothing about me likes the idea of preaching. I, I don't need people preaching to me. I, I turn, tune them out. I'm only, I'm only answering these questions as best I can. And I, know, and I know some of these questions aren't everybody's flavor. I get that. 